vitamin D deficiency symptoms? Evidence continues to accumulate supporting the role of vitamin D and the prevention and treatment of multiple sclerosis as it begins with the vitamin D levels in pregnant women. Numerous studies have linked the occurrence of MS with birth month. There is a high prevalence of MS in high latitude areas. The lack of sunlight exposure appears to be a significant predictor, and research is ongoing in this area. If this is your first visit to our channel, subscribe here for more health videos and get energizing, and advice on health. Tuberculosis Individuals with tuberculosis TB have been shown to have lower vitamin D levels than healthy people. Supplementation has shown to improve symptoms in these individuals. Further studies are needed to determine the cause and appropriate intervention. Reducing the risk of type 2 diabetes Research has shown that those with blood vitamin D levels over 25 nanograms per milliliter had a 43% reduced risk of developing type 2 diabetes compared with those with levels under 14 nanograms per milliliter. Decreasing inflammation Many of the health benefits associated with vitamin D may come from its role in decreasing inflammation. Research has shown a decrease in levels of C-reactive protein, a marker of inflammation, with increased levels of vitamin D to just below 21 nanograms per milliliter. Reducing risk of allergies in children and adolescents. A nationwide study of over 6,000 individuals showed that allergic sensitization was more common in those with vitamin D levels under 15 nanograms per milliliter versus those with levels 30 nanograms per milliliter or more. Sleep apnea There is some evidence that vitamin D deficiency may increase the risk of obstructive sleep apnea brought on by inflammatory rhinitis and or tonsillar hypertrophy. More research needs to be done to confirm this. Decreasing Dental Cavities A review of 24 controlled clinical trials encompassing 2,827 children found a 47% reduced risk of cavities with vitamin D supplementation. Possibly helping with erectile dysfunction ED It is not clear if increasing your serum vitamin D levels can help with ED. Many men diagnosed with ED are diagnosed with cardiovascular disease CVD within a few years. Vitamin D deficiency is linked with CVD, so if you are deficient in vitamin D, some researchers believe that treating this could reduce your risk of ED. Thanks for watching this video. Hit a like, turn on the notifications and enjoy receiving more form healthy life aim. Hoping to see you next time.